So Spotify isn't natively supported on SteamOS, and even worse, it's not natively supported on Debian Jesse. But it's still relatively easy and straightforward to get it installed. You just need the right repository and one extra package. So the first thing you'll want to do is open up a terminal and a browser window. Then we'll go to Spotify's Linux website. We'll go down to where the installation instructions are, and the first thing we'll do is copy the first line and paste it into our terminal. Now keep in mind that this is typically a very bad practice. You don't generally want to just copy and paste terminal commands from the internet, especially not ones that have sudo in them. So this first line here will actually add the Spotify signing key so you don't get a warning every time you try to update your repositories. Then we'll want to copy the second line and add the Spotify repository to our sources list. And finally we'll do sudo apt-get update and sudo apt-get install Spotify client. Now once that is finished we'll go ahead and type in Spotify into the terminal and you'll notice that it's complaining we're missing a dependency. Unfortunately this dependency has been deprecated in Debian Jesse which also means that SteamOS doesn't have it. So we'll need to go out and get that dependency. A quick Google search will find it as it's a very commonly asked question and we'll simply download it from the Debian repository. Now keep in mind that while you can add the repository for Wheezy, which is the previous version of Debian, you don't want to add that repository because we're already using the Jesse repositories. So once you download the dependency, go ahead and install it and then run Spotify again. And there you go. Spotify is now installed and you're free to log in.